What's up, my fellow fragmented fragrance of the fortuitous frontal lobe? I had to say that slowly, because I kept fucking it up. I fucked it up a whole one times. So I don't know why I said I kept fucking it up. But I wanted to make sure I got good, you know? And I think that was okay. And that's good in my book. Anyways. Boom, boom! It's the, it's the man. The cow. Um, if you weren't here late last time, shit was going crazy, and now we're in a flashback or something. I don't know. Welcome to the Blaze Berserk Experience. Hope you enjoy your stay. What? What's? Just opened a portal of time and space for a little bit. Let's take a little look. See, I was the count seven years ago. Bit more trim, I might add. And behold, it's your mother. Mother. A noble man it is beautiful, virtuous life, <gasps> a very family for the picture of happiness, as it would seem. S stop. Stop. <laughs> At this time, the land was overrun by the pagans in an attempt to destroy the heretics. The count hunted them down throughout his domain. Hence, he was often away from the castle. But one day... Exhausted from a long, harsh, heretic hunting campaign, the Count rushed back to the arms of the beloved wife and daughter in order to soothe his soul. Stop. Stop. And that's when it happened. Stop! <laughs> oh my god, a fucking goat orgy. I was... God damn, that's a lot of boobies I'm gonna have to censor, but... I'm gonna take a second to just appreciate that. There's n and the goat has a fucking boobies too. They, the homie be fucking. Oh, d what am I looking at? Jesus, just got boobies fucking everywhere. We love to see it, but goddamn, that's gonna put me like at least a minute of work, and that's too much for my stupid little lazy ass to do. Unfortunate, but on the bright side, I get to look at boobies while I do it. <laughs> goddamn, fuck it, just. Go orgy, there's a cauldron, man's be fucking. And, uh, Alright, pop off, homie, I guess. Oh, more boobies. Oh, I can't wait to censor all of this in editing. <laughs> so much boobies to censor. It was an uncanny sight. In the midst of a strange stretch of a wave of heat and a sea of flesh swarmed in tangled mess. Towering above it all was the statue of a grotesque god with the heart of a goat. That's just a statue? They be fucking statues? I've been down bad sometimes in my life, but never at once have I been this down bad over some statues. And entwined around that god as they cling to it was the fatigue of women writhing in ecstasy. Oh shit. Comforting his face in pleasure. It was the figure of a woman loved above all else. Oh, was that the homie's wife? That's, that's not true. It can't be true. Theresa! Theresa! Oh, oh, oh shit. Ooh. Ah, Ingy. The Count went to a blind rage. Oh, shit, homie. You murdered all those boobies. Those booby howevers are no more. <laughs> when he came to out of it, not a single person was moving. Only heaps of flesh and blood lay scattered about. And boobies. Look at those. Just a zoom in on boobies. More boobies. See that? He's about to murder his wife because her boobies are out. <laughs> Even more boobies I have to censor. Let's go. No. Stop. Stop. <laughs> oh. She wants to fuck. Oh, shit. <laughs> That's right. You couldn't do it. You couldn't call away your half of yourself. And seeing the trumpet, knowing the smile of your betrayer, you drove to the depths of despair. You decided to end your own life, to escape that despair. However, your despair itself was part of the circle of casualty. The wailing of your soul, which could never be eased by the gods of the world, opened the portal to another dimension. And you were just surrounded by even more and more boobies. Everywhere you looked, boobies, your worst nightmare. <laughs> and you said, Are you guys are just messengers from hell? It makes no difference whoever you are. Save me from my suffering. If you do, I'll give you anything. And we promised you 
that we would make you into a supernatural being who would never know shallow despair for a single phrase touch the boobies in exchange for one more phrase just one phrase touch the boobies T touch the boobies oh he's eating the boobies <laughs> That's him eating the boobies. She's got the fucking mark of the guts. What's that guts mark called? I don't fucking know. Do you hear that trash can? That's very fucking distracting. Do you hear that? Jesus. Fucking loud as shit. Anyways, I'm trying to look at some boobies right now. Get out of here, trash man. You trash. Trash man. <laughs> Anyways. Yes. Indeed. You said it. I offer this woman for sacrifice. The life you couldn't take by your own hand. The life of the person you loved and hated the most. You gave it to us. So that you could bury your fragile human heart. No. So that you could transcend your very humanity. Oh, there's the mark. We shall grant your burning desire. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, shit. Theresa! Hey, bug. Oh, hey, bug. All I need is my right arm. Make it so that I can use it. Hurry up. Do it now. Guardians of Desire, part five. End. And with that, I'm going to end it here. It's a little short boy today. But, like, you know, we had Satan goat summoning booby women and shit, you know? Sometimes you see that shit and you're like, that's enough today. I've processed a lot of information. I'm going to have to take a second to st stop and process it. So if you liked boobies, if you like boobies, we have a lot in common, you and I. So make sure to like, comment, subscribe. If you don't like boobies, fuck you. Still like, comment, subscribe, though. I appreciate you all being here. Thank you all for joining me. I'll see you all next time. Bye-bye.